today I want to show you some exercises you can do with or without baby, but if you've got baby, give them a nice big hug. We're gonna bring our feet together, draw our toes out and heels out here. And then what we're going to do is roll our shoulders back, neck nice and long, and we're gonna push our bottom back and gently down. So imagine you've got a little, little wall behind you and you're gliding down that wall and gently coming back. So if I give you a side view, you can see how my bottom's poking back, my hips are staying over my shoulders and gently down. I'm giving baby a nice big hug here as I'm coming down and back up. And you can do this nice and gently and then you can speed it up. If you want to make it a little bit more challenging and you don't necessarily want to use speed, what you can do here is go up towards the ceiling so you're on your tiptoes and then continue your squats. And then additional variations we can do to kind of change it up is open up your feet a little bit more, so wider than hip distance, roll your feet out, give baby that extra little hug, and down we go. And up. And again, you can add those tiptoes in, so you can lengthen up first of all, and get that added balance of using your toes, using the inner thighs there, as well as our quads as we come down, keeping those shoulders relaxed, neck nice and long. And if you're doing this without baby, you can bring your arms in and lengthen away as you're coming down. And then you can always hold it here and hold for a couple of seconds. That's when your legs start feeling a bit like jelly. And you can release your heels and come up in standing and relax. Hope that was useful. See you again soon.